Hey, you. Yes, you right there. Are you struggling with your 808s? If so, this is the video for you. Now just hold on, I still have more questions. So listen carefully. Are you a new producer? When you send your beats on Discord, are you getting told your 808s are off key? If you answered yes to both of those questions, you, you, you probably suck. I'm not okay, you probably suck. But I'll help you to fix your 808s. Here we go. Dude, I don't know what you're talking about, man. My 808s are clearly on key. Like, the sample says D sharp minor. I don't know what you hear, man. My 808s are on key. It's in the scale. Like, literally, the note says D sharp. So, you're wrong. I'm right. My 808s are on key. Like, listen to this heat, dude. Listen to it. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so, I'm so sorry, I had to hear that, but not. Please don't ever be like this. Don't ever be like this. It makes you look like an idiot, and you don't want to look like that. So for this, this is a simple solution to this. All right, so close to, we have the 808 right here. And what you want to do to tune it, if it's not in the right thing, you want to move it to the right note. So this, it says C, but sometimes it doesn't say C, so you're going to have to go by ear. A good tip to use is go like an octave down so that the notes appear high pitch and you can hear the actual tone instead of the sub. So for this, I'm going to put it back in C. And for the other 808, I'm going to do that. Here we go. Put it back at C because this is actually C2. And now it should sound way better and more on key. Like, listen to this. See, that sounds way better now. So using this tip right here, using this to set the root note so your bass can be even more in key is great. Using this, no, don't do it. Please don't do it. It's not good at all. Use this and it shall help you out. The fine tune, you don't want to mess with that either. So don't worry about that either. Just change it from right here. The hardest thing about this one is that you need to know your tones. So if you're like tone deaf, this is going to be a little bit difficult because you won't know it and you're just going to guess and hope it works. But if you do know your tones, then you should be straight on this one. This will work for it every time. And here's the next tip right here. And this is the tuner plugin that's in FL Studio already. This way is pretty difficult to set up in the first place. So in the mixer, I need there's this plugin called the tuner that just came out with FL Studio. I forgot what update it is, but it just came out. It's pretty new. And it's right here in the visual tab, right here, down here. So you click it, open it up, and you'll get this. So it says it's listening because it automatically works already. So if you're trying to tune a bass, you click this button down here that says bass. And it should turn orange. And turn this up too. Turn this up too. So boom, it should get it. D. This is C. This is actually C. So it tunes it no matter what note you're playing. Like I can turn this off key right now. Watch. See? It's off key. So if I put on C, it's going to give me F. G, G. See? G. So this note is in G. So we put it at G. So that C is actually C. So remember, turn on bass and then turn up the reactivity or also won't turn on. So please remember that because I messed up and didn't turn this on. I was playing and I was struggling for like a hot minute. So this way is pretty cool, but you're just tedious because you have to go and find it, put it in and then delete it afterwards. So you still have your 10 mixer tracks so for your effects. So yeah, this way is pretty okay. I don't use this myself, but it can help you to like really understand tones and notes and what actually works. So to use this, if you need help understanding tones and stuff like that, then you should be good to go to make sure your 808's on key for all of your beats. I also wanted to show you this sample that I made. It's pretty nice, the, 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 the um, bass. Um, I didn't want to forget to show you guys this.
I can't play the acapella. Shameless plug real quick. Uh, I just dropped a new sample pack, really unrelated to basses and 808 tuning, but it will, it's really nice if you go download it. I just hit 100 subscribers and this was like a celebration thing for me. So make sure to go get that. Should be link in the description if I don't forget. If not, it should be like the video right after this. So make sure to go get that, cook up some and, and go crazy with them.